It's all the news and it's all the time. Yes, it is. And uh, I thought today we'd look at some interesting news coming out uh, of the Mail Online, talking about Orlando Bloom. And he said, it says he's uh, showing off his toned pecs and rippling muscles as he goes shirtless on the set of a new movie, Wizards. I'm not even sure what Wizards is about at the moment. Alongside Pete Davidson in Cairns. So uh, there we have Orlando Bloom. He's got some sort of thing going on here. And uh, yeah, I don't know what this hair is doing. But uh, <laughs> he's busy working on his new film in Cairns, Queensland on Monday. British actor showed off his rippling muscles. I mean, he is looking jacked at the moment. As he shot scenes for upcoming comedy movie Wizards on a local beach. I'm going to have to look into this. The 45-year-old went shirtless, he did, flaunting his stacked pecs. I mean, who says that? Impressive guns while on set. Brilliant. So Orlando teamed a dark denim vest with a pair of loose slacks, his red underwear peeking out from under the waistband. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, OK. Uh, the star went barefoot and appeared in great spirits, laughing with his co-stars between takes. He also donned a dreadlocked hairstyle, yeah, I'm not. I'm not feeling that for the role. His long, fl- his long locks, flowing over his shoulders. Uh, yeah, I'm. Not, I'm not a fan of that look either. Uh, the British actor. We we know all that. There he. Is. <laughs> he looks like he's some sort of caveman in a, in a jungle or something. Okay, so uh, what's he got going on here? So he's got all these beads. Oh, he's got the Vitruvian Man. Is that um, is that Da Vinci? R- Vitruvian Man going on here? Is that a real tattoo or for the film? I don't know. Um, leave a note in the comment if you know whether that's uh, that's real or for the uh, film. So he wore a dark denim vest. Yeah, we know that. He's got some sort of sun thing. He's looking very lean. Got to say, that's that's very low body fat percentage. That look. Um, so Orlando Bloom enjoys his time in Australia. Well, those are sharks. So. <laughs> Also on set was his co-star Pete Davidson, who donned a pale yellow t-shirt with a graphic print, which had large stains on the front. Nice. 28-year-old added a pair of faded shorts, which were likewise stained <laughs> quality, like likely as part of his role. Okay. So he wore a green and white cap and relaxed between scenes while puffing on a cigarette. What's, what's going on here? Is this uh, like a, a castle? Like a... The sun, I don't know what that is. Um, so it's red underwear, yeah, they're going on about the underwear. And uh, oh, there's Pete Davidson. Oh, I mean, this isn't a SpongeBob. I mean, this is not a good look. That's that's not a good look going on there at all. Oi. Um, to be honest, I'm, I'm phew, he looks skinny and and generally dirty and this is not it looks like a desk in detention and these shoes Oy, that's I mean how what is that going on I mean this guy knows what he's doing like clearly yeah that's that's legit um, but how does how does this guy how does this guy score this girl Kim Kardashian I mean how does that work okay <laughs> moving on and uh, yeah so, so there you go and um, what else is going on so that's Kim Kardashian oh yeah some interesting stuff we've got a new shop now on the channel interesting new shop all the news and uh, what we've got is the logo uh, on pretty much everything all these things come in different colors so you can click this and then you can have like pinks you can have whatever that color is you can have another type of pink all sorts of different sizes greens not sure about the green quite like that that's quite nice so uh, yeah there's a new new store and uh, I was thinking to ask your opinion about what else should we have on the store at the moment we've got two basic concepts we've got all the news and we've got all the news all the time that's it um i was thinking do we put some some funny johnny depp memes some like comedy stuff i was like some examples uh lawyer did you see what happened after you left and johnny's saying i wasn't there after i left still makes me laugh (laughs) 
<laughs> yeah, it's still funny. Um, or do we put some cool, like, sexy shots of Johnny in there on the t-shirts? Whichever ones I can get away with in terms of copyright. Which would you prefer? Let me know. Uh, do you want funny ones? Or would you like cool and sexy ones? Um, up to you. I put a poll in the uh, community tab if you want to vote on it. That would be fantastic. Going back to uh, Orlando Bloom. Not this guy. That guy. Orlando Bloom. Um, yeah, he's from this area of the UK. He's from the southeast um, near Canterbury. And uh, I, was little, I was looking him up. And it says uh, Orlando Bloom School. He attended uh, St. Peter's Methodist Primary School, then the Junior School of King's School, before he went to St. Edmund's in Canterbury. I was, I was looking at those. This is Canterbury. This is the southeast of England on the southeast coast. This is France here. And uh, yeah, this is, this is the old uh, Canterbury. And down here, is King School. Where's King School? Um, yeah, here. This is one of the most poshest school in schools in the whole of the UK. It's got a sixth century church ruin in the school. This church is from 500 AD. Crazy, crazy place. Um, so this is the King School. Really expensive as well to send your kids there. And uh, that's what the outside, that's the gate, what it looks like. I spent a lot of time here actually. And um, St Edmunds is very similar. If I zoom out a bit, I'll uh, go into St Edmunds. This is St Edmunds school. And it's got a very similar sort of look to it. Oh, but not if you go to the bushes. Yeah, so that's St Edmunds. Very nice schools. Very nice schools. Um, I went to university here, University of Kent. And I was in Keynes College. So yeah, very close. So that's uh, Canterbury and uh, where Orlando Bloom is from. And uh, yeah, this is uh, Orlando Bloom. He's going out. He's married to Katy Perry and they met in 2016 and they broke up and then they got back together again and there's a whole list of stuff that happened and then they had a lovely child called Daisy Dove Bloom I think they just picked three random words so, the <laughs> so there you go so that's really nice so Orlando Bloom's out making nice films and uh, yeah so let me know what you think about uh, various things. Should we have cool, classy, sexy, or should we have funny? Don't know. And uh, memes, generally they being cool. And uh, Canterbury. So yeah, let me know what you think, and uh, I will catch you guys later.